Hello, it's Donnie from the Philomath Montessori School, and today I'm going to make a torn paper collage. At the Philomath Montessori School, when we use white glue, school glue, we dispense it into little shells, seashells. And I happen to have a lot of seashells at my home. I have a big seashell collection. So I took one of my seashells to use for my glue dish. But if you don't have a seashell, you could use a small dish. You could use a plastic lid from a yogurt container or something like that. Some people can use the glue right out of the bottle, but I have a very hard time controlling the amount that way, so I won't do that. Maybe you have a glue stick. A glue stick would also work for this project. One thing we have at school that I don't have here at my home are little glue brushes. My husband has some very nice paint brushes, but he would not want me to use them for glue. He takes very good care of his paint brushes. But I do have cotton swabs. Do you know cotton swabs? People use them to clean out their ears. Um, so I'm going to use that to apply my glue. That will be my applicator. Today I'm going to make a torn paper collage of the Zagros Mountains in Iran. So I just had, I took two pieces of colored paper but if I didn't have this colored paper, I would be happy to make it out of magazine pages. I would just tear it out of magazine pages or newspaper or used office paper that my parents told me I could use. But I have this nice construction paper, so I'm going to use that. This will be my mountain. I'm going to tear a mountain shape. Now mountains come in all kinds of shapes. They don't all look like our Mount Hood. Our Mount Hood looks like that, doesn't it? It's so perfect and triangular. But not all mountains look like that. Some of them come in very irregular shapes. So really, however my mountain shape turns out, is going to be just fine. starting to look like a mountain range, isn't it? I don't like this straight side here. How can I get rid of that straight side? Well, that's not straight anymore, is it? Maybe that's looking more mountainous. That is adequate. Adequate means good enough. That will be my mountain. And um, I know that the Elbers Mountains in Iran are thickly forested. They are the last thickly forested area in the Middle East. Um, and I know I wanted to make the Zagros Mountains, but I'm going to cover this with trees. The Zagros Mountains have a lot of trees too. My trees will be all different kinds of shapes. Trees come in different shapes. Some of them are kind of columnar, shaped like a column. Can you see what I'm doing? There, now you can see what I'm doing. I'm putting glue on my tree, on the back side of the tree. Put 
that on my mountain. Some trees are kind of round at the top. I wonder if I can tear a round shape. That's a nice shape. I could leave that like it is and it could be a bush or I could put it on a tree trunk and it could be a tree. Bush, tree. Hmm, I think I'll make it a tree. Now I'm just getting started, but I'm going to put a forest all over my mountain. And that will be my torn paper collage today. If you make a torn paper collage, you can make it be anything you want. It doesn't have to be a mountain with trees. It could be anything in the world. I won't even give you any ideas because I know that you can think of some great ideas for your torn paper collage. Um, when I put aside my collage, when it's all finished, I'll put it aside to dry. I will pick up every scrap of my torn paper. I will not leave scraps for others to find. I will pick up every scrap and I will save them for another collage later. I will, hmm, I think I will save this. I will use it again later. Maybe I'll just rest it on a piece of paper so it doesn't get things sticky. Just put it on a piece of paper so it doesn't get things sticky. And after I've used up my glue and my collage, I will wash out my shell at the sink so that it is ready for my collage the next time. I will look at my underlay and if it has any glue on it, I will get a sponge and I will wipe the glue off of it so that it is nice the next time I go to use it. I'll clean everything up. I hope you will too. Enjoy making your creative torn paper collage and have a super duper day. Bye bye.